Hey guys, so in this video, I am just going for a quick ride just by myself up at Ledgeview in Abbotsford, BC, where I live. Just my local trails. I ride here quite a bit. Pretty much whenever I go up here, I always go to the plow first, hit these jumps for a few times before going to the top and riding paper route. Love hitting the 35 footer and then even the 45 footer here. It's a lot of fun. Doesn't have the greatest landing though, but. And I think I just broke that jump, even though like no one rides it anyway. It's getting pretty weak. And for those wondering about the uh, the wrist thing that I'm wearing around my uh, wrist there, it's actually to protect my thumb because about six years ago I tore a tendon in my thumb, had to have surgery, I, uh, I lost movement in my thumb and uh, basically the only purpose of that is to protect it from getting pulled back. I guess I just still kind of wear it just in case I were to hit my thumb, I just don't want it to get pulled back, I don't want to damage it. It may not be the most necessary thing but it doesn't really hinder me in any way so. Some pretty nice views up at Ledgeview there. You can see quite a ways out, it's pretty nice. And then now let's go ride Paper Route. And every shot I'm filming in this video is at 4K 30 frames a second. Uh, and I always use Pro 2 mode, um, native white balance. Our exposure compensation is always at negative one. Flat mode, and then I always have to color correct it. Problem is, it was getting a little dark, so the footage may look a little bit mushy. Because uh, as it gets darker, the shutter speed goes down as slow as it can go, which would be a thirtieth of a second, since the frame rate is 30 frames per second. So some of the footage can be a little bit blurry, and uh, that's unfortunate. It's in these kind of settings when it would be wise to uh, record at 60 frames, like 2.7K 60 frames so that the shutter speed can't go so slow anymore. For some of this last footage, I actually put the exposure compensation to negative two to see how that would look. And so it's going even a little bit darker yet than it may normally want to, but it actually still looks fine, honestly. ride. It was a pretty nice ride. This was earlier on, uh, later summer in September I think it was. Great conditions. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed my video. Give me a comment, tell me what you think. Give a like and subscribe. I've got a Facebook page and an Instagram page. Check those out. And I'm also selling shirts on my Spreadshirt store. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe for more videos.